Uh, but of course, this shows the example that um, uh, also sustainability sometimes does not uh, rely on the stable grounds of uh, the good stuff. So, hello everybody and welcome in Sofia, in the Rida Dance Center. I have the pleasure to have a very uh, big friend of mine and uh, professional that I always was uh, fascinated from uh, their work in Jerusalem and the house that they run and very sustainable independent model, Ruby Edelman. Try to imagine how it looks before you saw it. And Igor brought some uh, headsets so you're going to have a chance to see it. But if you feel that because you cannot imagine it or something is missing in the technology or the explanation, ask it, ask it, ask it. My name is Igor Sunkovic. I'm a cinematographer and many other stuff. So what we are doing, we are not creating, we are documenting works. We are not creating works specially for this technology. First impact that whatever we do has uh, influence in the nature. So essentially we're going to play two videos. One is our most recent work and the other is a collection of all of our selected works. Then we had buses and then uh, we were asked to do a plane, but that fell through and uh, I think we haven't done a boat. I think that's the, the one that we haven't done. Well, I'm an electronic music producer for the last 25 years and uh, I worked in very different music genres from um, uh, drum and bass to ambient music, IDM, down tempo, jazz, trip hop, uh, world music. That's how the whole global economy is built. Like even doing this constantly on your phone is consuming. It's giving your data to advertisers that can sell you stuff like Brad Pitt is saying here, buying shit we don't need. I think we all agree that this is the highest values of humanity. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Philosophy, art. When everyone was in lockdown, what would people do? They would start to sing, dance, read read books, all kind of cultural things. So when, when you put a human in, into free time or, or into his space, he will start to be creative. 